Hello patrons, I'm Tom and I'm here today to break down the drums to our new single, Walking on Broken Glass. This song was written in around the winter of 2019 and like most songs on this new record it was written really with an acoustic guitar and without much thought into how the drums or the arrangement was going to pan out. The only thing I had in mind was to make the most of the guitar stabs throughout the track. London Calling came to mind, I remember thinking of that song. Right before lockdown hit we courageously kept going and retreated to the top of a hill in the Yorkshire Dales. It was Nettlebed Farm where all these songs we had done acoustically really came to life and the arrangements came to us naturally. Anyway, to the important stuff. The drums. Well firstly the tempo. We played around with the tempo quite a lot. It started as a fairly slow track on the acoustic guitar and then when we got the band together it was a real quick track and then like everything in life it ended up right in the middle. The track was 142.5 BPM. The drum beat is real simple. It's an Earl Young 4 on the floor. Uh, And that's, uh, you know, four on the kick, uh, snare on two and four, and eighth notes on the hi-hat. I do occasionally add in an open hi-hat with the kick on four and, and that, you know, I borrowed from Al Jackson Jr. Most of the drum fills on this track are with one hand. An easy way to do a spacious drum fill is just to use one hand so you hit it like this. Now we're on to the pre-chorus. The guitar part on the pre-chorus is quite open, but we move on to the floor tom. I really like the, the little rumble that the uh, floor tom has on this recorded track and it worked with the guitar, but the main reason was just so when we went back to the chorus, the hi-hat sounded fresh again. It's the same beat, four on the floor, snare on two and four, but just the, the, the floor tom with the eighth notes. Ah, we're at the big time, the chorus, and yeah, you, you guessed it, it's the exact same beat. But this time the hi-hat is a little more open. There is a thrill in particular I'd like to show you. It goes into the solo on the right, and I wanted to get off the snare. Solo for this track, we move on to the ride and we change the beat. However, this time it kicks on one and three and three and with the snare and two and four.
This has been uh, the first time I've taught pretty much anything in my life, so I hope it's been a little bit useful. And if you want any more insight, just ask us some questions and we'll, we'll get back to you for sure. And if you want us to do another one, I'll, I'll be up for doing another one. Let us know what you think and uh, comment and share the Patreon page because, you know, it's a, it's a new and, and a good way to communicate with, with you all. And, uh, well, frankly, you know, we need as much money as we can. See you next month for more tricks with Tom. <laughs>